like like how he said you can um oh oh uh, this again is 15 and a half mm -hmm. maybe we can measure from here to here and we can add it but that's what one of your classmates said right yes that's what she said oh. that's what no. she said she said going like this <laughs> this measure and then measure the from here to here, okay. and then you can add it. And then we can add it. Okay. What if this did not exist? You can take it back to your table with you, please. If this did not exist, we didn't have a ruler. We don't have a yardstick. The ruler and yardstick monster came and took them all away. We don't have any more. He came for Halloween. He took them all. Gone. Now, I'm still stuck with my problem. I still don't know what to do. I still haven't figured out which one is longer. All right? What I want you to do, discuss it. Figure out how would you know which one of these is longer. And then one person is going to report to me. One person is going to let me know what your team thinks. Okay? The best strategy or the best way to figure out which one of these lines is the longest. Do we understand the instruction? Yeah. I see your hand, Jules. You ready? All right? Come on up. Stay here. You're the teacher for a minute. Stand up and talk to us. Tell us what was your conjecture, if it was right or wrong, and why. The conjecture was correct because I estimated the size of the first figure and it was going to be larger than the second one. Okay, so your conjecture was what? That when I saw the first figure, I saw it and I saw like the sizes and I knew it was going to be bigger than the, I mean, larger than the other one. Okay, and how did you get to the answer? How did you get to that answer? Um, this one, we just use the artist and this one, we um, use the string, and then we um, measured the string, and we um, got our answer, which was 74 and a half was less than 94 inches.